it's Janice Baylor back with you in my studio and for another fun film drop-in art session I would like to thank Perry County Council of the Arts and participating partners for continuing to sponsor our drop-in sessions virtually. Today we are going to make a really fun project inspired by the characters of Mo Willems and his Pigeon series of books. So we are going to make fun puppets that you can use to act out the story. We'll make a pigeon and we'll make a duckling and then all you have to do is supply the hot dog. So stay tuned for the supplies and how to create these fun little projects coming right up. For today's project, you will need a pair of scissors, some blue, yellow, and orange construction paper, not very big pieces, some popsicle sticks, some muffin liners in yellow and blue, a black marker, some white cardstock, and some glue. To get started making our pigeon and duckling little puppets, what you'll need to do is fold your muffin wrapper in half for each color. And then we need to apply them onto the popsicle stick about halfway in the midway point. You want the flat part of your muffin liner to be facing up where we're going to put the head. So then we need to cut out a circle for both the blue for the pigeon and yellow for the duckling. So just a little stripe of glue and apply your muffin liner. And you can add a little glue so it doesn't poof up too much to the inside. I really think Mo Willems is a fun author. We like to read the duckling and pigeon books in our house, as well as pig. Then you just need to cut a small to medium circle out of both colors, blue and yellow, and these will be the heads, duckling, and the pigeon and just kind of put them slightly off of center so that the front of the head will sit out over one edge of the, um, the muffin liner a little bit more than the other. Then we need two triangles of orange paper. And you just want to glue those on to the one side of your circle. And then we need to make that classic large Mo Willems eye for our duckling and pigeon. So I'm just going to cut two at a time. You could trace a little cap if you need to, to make a circle, or I'm just gonna freehand a circle for each one. And then he always applies his eyeballs in the center. So we're just gonna color some big circles in the center of each white circle with our black marker. And then we will affix those to our, oh no, my duckling got a droopy mouth. There we go. And there you have some really cute duckling and pigeon characters, a la the style of Mo Willems. And you can go act out some of the silly little books. And you could also probably make additional characters if you wanted to. But these are really fun. Don't steal my hot dog. Thanks for joining me today, friends. Have a great day.